sorry, no gaming videos this week. But check this out. How do you do, everyone? Yeah! Hi, guys. What's up, everyone? Hi, guys. Hi. What's up, you beautiful bastards? Welcome. What's up, hey, early? What is up, guys? Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hi, Zayn. Okay. Happy New Year! What's up, guys? <laughs> Reporting live. Dragons. Yo, what's good? Hi, sisters. Welcome back. What's up, everybody? Hey, everyone. Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, guys. Oh, hey, guys. We've got appearances by Casey Neistat, Hannah Stocking, Jack Douglas and Gus Johnson, Rosanna Pansino, Kaylin Allen, Patrick Starr, Jay Shetty, Nikita Dragon, and so many more. With performances by Kim Petras and Normani. This is the YouTube Streamy Awards, brought to you by Black Christmas. And now, please welcome your... Oh, wait a minute. Is anyone hosting this thing? Well, one host when you can have eight hosts. I just took a BuzzFeed quiz. Turns out I'm a hundred percent Hufflepuff. Even when I'm not uploading, yeah, it's 2019 and we did hella big things. PewDiePie had 100 late night, got Lily. So remember, it's so for brands here. You getting paid. Put a smile on. I throw no shade. Smash almost got shut down. Give it up for us, bitches, one more time. We are live from the Beverly Hilton. We're so happy to be here with you. Tonight is all about celebrating our diverse global community and all the amazing content that's been created this year. We've got a great show, don't we, Kate? <laughs> Oh yeah, we've got all your favorite creators plus two incredible musical performances. That's right, Kim Petras and Normani are in the house! We also have more than a few surprises and you know you can trust me on surprises. And this is gonna be one of the best streamies ever because we've got an award presenter unlike any other. You know her as the kombucha girl, but more importantly, her name is Brittany Tomlinson. And Brittany! How do you feel about the streamies this year? Ah! Oh, that was very good. Very good. Word. Okay, y'all, let's turn this party. Here to present our first award, give it up for... Elmill! Turn 
to YouTube for the answers to life's heavy questions. How do you execute the perfect smoky eye? How long can a cat hold on to a ceiling fan before flying across the room? How do you say diarrhea of medication in Japanese? But me, I'm in it for the comedy. This award is for the YouTubers who make us laugh with their pranks, mom impersonations, and fake apology videos. Check out the nominees in this package by Danny Casal. <laughs> All right, all right, I got a good joke for you. Listen to this one. Okay, cool man, coffee, Dan. What did the sushi say to the bee? Mm, the what? Wasabi. Oh, ah, 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 <laughs> See, ah, I knew you liked that one. Ah, funny, right? Yeah, really funny. Ah, <laughs> thank you. If, if I tell a joke, do you promise to laugh? Yeah, I, I promise. I need a verbal agreement. A verbal agreement? Did, did, did I stutter? A little bit. I had my lawyer prepare a contract. Failure to fulfill these terms will result in the termination of friendship. Okay, okay, fine. I, I, pro I promise to laugh. <clears throat> what did the sushi say to the bee? Wait, that's my, that's my Wasabi. joke. Wasabi! Ah, 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 wow, that's hilarious! What? Well, I'm glad somebody thinks so. You can't just take my joke. Sarah, do I know you? Oh my god. And the nominations for comedy are... I, I can't with this guy. And what you buy? I've known you for seven years! How could you sleep with my girls? What? Bro, you're in your boxer! Caleb City! I hear everybody always want to talk about flies being dirty, but anybody in here want to volunteer to clean up literal doo doo water? Gus Johnson! Harry Potter had Down syndrome. What? What does that even mean? Professor Snake was a single mother. Alright, stop! Stop! Anna Stocking! What if we get caught? Oh my god, Mary! Don't be such a spooky little mother. And Jack Douglas. Yes, look how natural you look. Hey, uh, save some babes for the rest of us, my man. Fix your body. And the streaming for comedy goes to... <laughs> Jack Douglas. <laughs> I think there's been an error, um, but uh, no, thank you so much, uh, Streamies. Um, thank you to everyone uh, who watches. I, I gotta shout out my fellow nominees, too. Seriously, can we give it up to the other nominees in this category? <laughs> Except Gus Johnson. This is such a cool <laughs> honor. Hate him. Uh, this is so interesting. No, I, uh, I, I, I. I don't know, I was not expecting this. This is a very cool treat. Um, I won't take up any more of your time. Uh, tip your bartenders. Thanks so much, everyone. Good night. Dreamies are just getting started. Coming up, Patrick Starr slays. Brandon Rogers plays. Fitness Marshall starts a craze. Kate the Chemist will amaze. Hannah Stocking does the holidays. Plus, Kim Petras and Normani set the stage ablaze. You won't want to miss this. Yo, what's up? My name's Blame. I'm 22, and when I die, I'm going to help the life player. Yo, I've been a member of every gang you could think of, dog. The Scooters, the Cranks, the Zucchini Brothers. No matter what happens this time, I stay until morning. Oh my god, dude. This is about to be awesome. The, the most top haunted. two most haunted places are the 11th and 10th floor, and this has both. The only room in the entire hotel that has both. Check every room, check every room. So there I was, getting the teapot ready for Wilfer and I, cause you know how we like to sip some tea on this channel from time to time, and I turn around for a couple of seconds to call Wilfer in the kitchen, and as I do that, he looks at me like, uh, Andre, you might want to turn around and check up on that James Charles tea, cause it's spilling all over the place. Please, so welcome to this stage, the Streamy Social Good Honoree for Explore.org. Explore's streams started as a way to bring nature into people's homes. 
Um, our founder, Charlie Annenberg, believes that people will protect what they care about. And we hoped that by bringing brown bears, polar bears, coral reefs, wild birds into people's homes, that people would take action to protect our planet. We are honored to be the stewards of this thing that has become a testament to the power of online communities to make a difference in our world. Please welcome to the stage Streamy Social Good Award honoree, Attention and Zillow, Finding Home in America. Without platforms like YouTube, without partners like Zillow, these stories can't come to light. And everyone in this room, uh, all the stories that we saw today, obviously make a huge difference, and we're happy to just play a little part in that as well. Welcome back to the Streamies. We are coming to you live from the Beverly Hilton in LA. Such an amazing city full of arts, culture, and uh, beautiful landmarks, of course. It's too bad, though, none of us are going to um, ever see those because we're always stuck inside making videos. Well, I take that back. It's not entirely true. Sometimes we're stuck inside editing those videos. So I'm just glad I got to leave the house tonight. Now give it up for your next presenters, Zane and Heath. You got this, okay. We're here tonight to present the award for best collaboration. We collab all the time, and I think we're pretty good at it. <laughs> yeah. We're like the yin and the yang. Ooh. The hip to the ha. Okay. The blue to the jeans. Ooh, the you to the two. Okay. Thank you. See? Collaboration, collaboration just comes naturally to us. <laughs> here are Trixie and Katya with the nominees for best collaboration. <laughs> So this is the streamies, huh? Looks very dry. I know what you're thinking, it's big, dry, and gaping, but we're at the Grand Canyon. <laughs> well, at least the cops stopped chasing us. This is the police. Turn off your engine. Oh. I repeat, oh. turn off your engine. Oh. 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 Oh, it's a helicopter. Oh. This could be Tyler Oakley arriving. <laughs> Before we announce the best collaboration, I want to know that you, my collaborator, I'm so happy to have you as my friend. I'm sorry, what? Never mind. Okay. Let's drive off a cliff. Good idea. <laughs> and the nominees are David Dobrik and Kylie Jenner, Molly Burke and the Dolan Twins, Patrick Starr and Naomi Campbell, Rebecca Zamolo and the Game Master Network. <laughs> Sophie Dossi and Matt Stepanida. And the winner is... <gasps> <laughs> and the streamy for best collaboration goes to... He doesn't have a letter opener. <laughs> <clears throat> oh my God. David Dobrik and Kylie Jenner. everybody. Kylie's running late. Um, Hi, I'm Kylie Jenner. <laughs> um, no, I never know what to say during these, but um, I really want to say thank you. I'm sure Kylie really appreciates this too. I'm just so confused that she let me hang out with her in my car for more than two hours. So thank you to Kylie and thank you to you guys for voting or however this works. And David worked with Kylie Jenner so many days this year. They worked so hard. They saw each other every single day working for this award. So thank you. On behalf of Kylie Jenner, David spends every moment with Kylie Jenner. Thank you, Kylie, for selling half of your company just so we can work together on more collabs. I appreciate you looking out. Thank you, guys. Please welcome these two creative weirdos, Kate Albrecht and Joey Zare of Mr. Kate. Okay, the lifestyle category is near and dear to our hearts. We've collaborated with many of you out here in the audience, making over your spaces. Okay, Joey Graceffa's table is totally not. No, Kate, okay, no, no, you no. can't go make over Joey Graceffa's table just, right it's now. It's going to take two seconds. Kate. No, 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 I got, I got, I got surprised. You can't go no, no, make no. over. Oh, no, just, trust me, just hang on. All right, I got well, it. Well, Joey, throw to the nominees. Okay, while well, Kate does that, check out the nominees me. for no. lifestyle in this package by Andre Turba. I'm coming. 
All right, so we've got the streamies envelope right here. Let's do this. The nominees are, God damn it, Wilford, get back here with that. Boom, what's up everyone, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today- Uh, hi there, sorry. Have you seen a goose holding an envelope by any chance? No? <laughs> okay. Hey bitches, Brett here, and for today's video, bitch. Hey, have you seen a purple goose holding a- Bitch. Oh wow, no need to be rude. Hey guys, I'm Nikki. And I'm Gabby. And I'm looking for a goose. He's about this tall, holding an envelope? No? Hello you guys, and welcome back to my channel. What is good? I'll tell you what's not good is that I lost the streamies envelope and I'm in big trouble. Okay, bye. What are you gonna get out of here with your boba straw? Ew. Wilfred, there you are. Put it in the pot, <laughs> damn it. No, don't put it in the pot. Are you crazy? Give me that. No, come on. No, 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 no. Oh, that was pretty good. There she blows. <sighs> are you proud of yourself, Wilfer? The nominees are Brent Rivera, Bretman Rock. Nikki and Gabby, Ricky Thompson, and Sophia Nygaard. So much better, right? This here, yes, What's vintage that? key. No, no vintage key here. Oh, okay. Books, right. vintage books. Oh my gosh, so much better, right, my Joey's? This is some witchcraft. How do you do this? <laughs> Glue gun. All I right, way to it. go, Kate. Should we announce the winner of the lifestyle category? All oh, right, yes, yes, please. Ooh, All right, the streamy for lifestyle goes to. Wow, I'm bad at open envelopes, apparently. Whoa, it's really sealed, guys. That was with a glue gun. <gasps> Ricky Thompson! Oh my god, wow, uh, yes! Oh, wow, I was not expecting this. Wow, oh my God. Woo, okay, okay, okay. Woo, oh my gosh, woo. Okay, so, oh my gosh, I'm so happy right now. I literally am, okay. So first, I wanna thank God, amen. Thank you, Jesus, amen. Um, then I wanna thank uh, my friends and my family. Like, thank y'all so much for always being there for me. All the positive vibes, thank you so much. I would think my team, oh my God, you guys are working me, but I live for y'all. Yes, Pranav, where you at? Where you at? Yes! <laughs> um, then I want to thank my fans. Thank you guys so much, so much, so much. It makes me feel so good that I can make people laugh when they're feeling sad or whatever. I want to be that friend that y'all turn to when you're feeling sad. That's it, you know? And then last, you know I got to thank my haters because baby, I got a streamy, what's really good? Hey! <laughs> thank y'all. <laughs> Coming up, Emma Chamberlain gives some advice to the breakout creator nominees. Kean and JC hand out the award for gaming. And later, the streamy dance nominees head to Old Town Road. We'll be back in two. Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy Award winners. Car company, and you don't even know it. Jeep, owned. Acura, owned. Chevy, come on, owned. So the question is, who owns who? Or is it whom? Andrew, we're back at Chosun Galbi, where we were in our season one Korean barbecue episode. We just opened it about 32 years ago. So we're now in the third episode. I'm the best trash talking mascot in town. You might be the king, but a clown wears the crown. Where's the beef? Where's the beef? Where's the beef? the history of the streamies. The streamies were invented in 1972. In 1800 BC. When Will Smith and Joanne the Scammer. And Abraham Lincoln and Zac Efron got together and decided it was time to jump the internet. They needed to sword fight. The internet 
The first streamies, some would say, was pretty sexy. Sexy. Things ran lively. Ran crazily. There were quite a few dogs. And one or two chairs. Crickets, fishes, horses. And one or two balls. This year's streamies is going to be smelly. Elon Musk is here. Jane Dawson is here. Quite fluffy. Will Lily Singh's record of most dramatic wins be beat this year? Will David Dobrik take home the most babies? Who? That last part was spicy. And now, a public service announcement from Emma Chamberlain. Hey! Hey, everybody. I hope you're all having an extravagant evening. So during last year's Streamy Awards, I was blessed enough to win the Breakout Creator Award. And it was great, but I had to give a speech, which I was not expecting. And it showed a little bit. My speech was definitely not as good as I think, um... I wish it would have been. I'm human, I tried my best. So it's been a year since that speech and I thought, why not watch it and give some advice about how you can give a good acceptance speech. Um, I'm scared, but. Okay, so I started my speech out with some honesty. I admitted to the crowd that I was scared and I was. So honestly, I don't hate this so far. I just wanna say thank you guys for being so welcoming because I'm, New, you know? You can hear in my voice the discomfort. Obviously what I said didn't really make much sense. I was just trying, <laughs> okay? So, I mean, I give myself credit for trying and at least I said thank you. That's always good, saying thank you is good. Um, it's been great. Thanks, I guess. I love you mom and dad. Uh, you could hear in my voice that I was about to cry out of fear. <laughs> now that we've watched that, now that we've analyzed that, let me give some tips. Number one, there's no need to be scared. Nobody's judging. Some people are judging, but it's fine. Just be yourself. Second tip is to be more sure about what you're saying. I feel like in my speech, I was kind of like, um, uh, thanks, I guess. And my last tip is to plan ahead. Might as well plan ahead and have a speech prepared in your mind, at least a little bit, so that you don't go on stage feeling unprepared, etc., etc. I hope that we learned something, and I hope you all have a great night. Peace out, and thank you guys for being so awesome. He's a tech geek, and she's a pretty little lore. Give it up for Marquez Brownlee and Lore DIY. Great advice, Emma. She's right. The next award is a big one. I think it's the only time a breakout is a good thing. Truth. So Breakout Creator celebrates the YouTubers who burst onto the scene this year and won us over by letting it all hang out. From music videos to breakup videos, planting trees to going to prom, these creators all left us wanting more. Check out the nominees. Breakout creator, Danny Gonzalez. That was too hard. They need to make that easier. That is a weird thing to do. Joanna Cedia. Despite all of this, I'm still trying to lead a normal life. Lorray. My room is currently a mess, but so is my wife, so <laughs> nothing new here. Lizzie Capri. We are at Carter's house and we're gonna try to sell him some books. And Mr. Beast. We are opening the world's first free store. And the streamy for the breakout creator goes to Mr. Beast. <laughs> Unfortunately, unfortunately, Mr. Beast could not be here tonight. He's out saving the world. <laughs> but we are honored to accept the award on his behalf. I texted him asking him if he wanted to say anything, and he has not gotten back to me yet, so <laughs> just clap it up. Good job, Mr. Beast. I'm excited to spend the break with you guys. I'm gonna go get Christmas lights for the dinner decor. Uh, do Christmas lights expire? Where's Helena? Love you too. Sorry. We shouldn't have let her go back by herself. She's fine. Come on, live a little. No, 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 please, no, no, no. Someone of my roommates heard missing. 
If I were missing, I'd want you to unleash the bloodhounds and track me down. You were at the DKO fraternity last night. Still creating problems, huh, right? I will bring you to your knees. Up next, Paris Hilton introduces an icy performance by Kim Petras when the YouTube Streamies, brought to you by Black Christmas, returns. Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy Award winners. Okay, so I'm a little nervous because no one's ever really seen the inside of my house. Now, not because I don't, I don't mind, you know me, I, I'm, I've shot off my whole life on the internet. Yeah. From cars to bags to surgeries. Right. Um, but me and Nate do try to keep a little bit of privacy for the internet. But um, I think once you buy three houses, you just gotta get over it and show one. To my esteemed friends, I invite you all to attend a dinner party. <laughs> Unleashed an evil. Oh. <laughs> Put it in. Hurry, guys! And it crept inside me. Streamy's Social Good Award honoree, 21 Savage, Leading by Example Foundation, and Juma. Thank you, Streamies, for recognizing and seeing the growth and the evolution. And that's that's what it's really about, is con creating a connection and an emotional connection that's constantly evolving through these campaigns. I just want to um, thank everyone uh, for being part of this. And uh, this is a really exciting time, and we can really change the world. Our final award today is honoring a creator who has united together their audience to multiply their collective social good efforts. Gigi Gorgeous. My main message is just to do whatever you feel in your heart. It's never too late, it's never too soon to start and be who you truly are because there's no better feeling than being completely authentic. Thank you, Streamies. She's a businesswoman, DJ, actress, fashion designer, and now Streamies presenter. Please welcome Paris Hilton. What's up, guys? Thanks for being here tonight at the Beverly Hilton. I love having people over. I'm here to introduce the next musical performance. She's my pop princess, little sis, and she's been killing it on tour all around the world. Even though I like things to be hot, we're about to catch a chill. Here to perform her hit song, Icy. Give it up for my girl, Kim Petras.
You can't get more dynamic than this duo. Give it up for Kian Lawley and JC Kalen. What's up, everybody? Can you hear me? What's happening? Uh, JC, I have a question for you. I got your question, Kian. Do you like playing games? Oh, yeah. Like uh, tic tac toe and hopscotch and thumb war. I wasn't talking about those games. I was talking about like online games, brother. Oh, you mean like when we made a bunch of our friends stay in a house and wait for them to leave so they can win some money. Ooh, like, like the Reality, reality House, House season two premiering in 2020? Yeah, coming, That's to, what I was coming to YouTube near you. I wasn't talking about those games. I was actually oh. talking about video games. Oh, you mean like a, a Minesweeper. I love Minesweeper. That's my favorite. Whatever. Here are the nominees for gaming. Hey, guys. We're the Merrill Twins, and we're introducing the nominees for gaming. And I think we should do it dressed as Minecraft characters. Cool! Um, why am I a Minecraft villager? Meh. <gasps> uh, I don't want anyone to see me like this. I think we should get PewDiePie's chair. What are we gonna do with this chair? Everybody loves Minecraft. Meh. <laughs> no, I mean, yes, but it's PewDiePie's chair. It's a meme. <laughs> but can you do this? No, Minecraft! <laughs> PewDiePie's chair! No Minecraft! Minecraft! Oh, um, sorry about that. Uh, here, here are the, the nominees, nominees for gaming. gaming. The, the completionist. completionist. Imagine trying to fight an enraged bear with a paperclip. Dashy Dash Games. Damn. This ain't no game. The Game Theorists. I know a lot of us tend to get cynical about events like this, myself included. Girlfriend Reviews. This is a new segment I'm gonna call Girlfriend Tips. Preston Plays. I don't have time to explain it. There's an infection and it's going to destroy everything. And the winner is... <laughs> <laughs> All right, and the Streamy Award for Gaming goes to... Whoa! The Game Theorists! <laughs> Thank you guys so much! Oh my god, I, I, we didn't expect this, so this is unbelievable. Guys, we did it! Yes! God, uh, look, it shows that I can grow hair, my friends. Uh, I do normally have hair. I apologize to everyone uh, if you're getting blinded by my bald spot right now. Uh, um, no, the uh, thank you guys so much for believing in us. I've always felt like, um, like someone who 
who never really belonged, right? Uh, who never really found my place. Even, even in gaming, we're this weird hybrid of education and gaming and YouTube commentary. And so thank you. Thank you for believing in us and accepting us into your community and, and making us finally be able to have a place where we feel, find, feel comfortable and have a home with all you amazing people who are doing a great difference in the world every single day by building communities of, zero, of your own. Digital video truly is changing the world one step at a time, and I can't thank you enough. I am so proud of each and every one of you in this room and at home, large and small creators, and I'm honored to be a part of you. Thank you for this. Still ahead, Jack Douglas and Gus Johnson present the award for fashion. Normani takes the streamy stage with a little motivation. And after the show, stay right here on the Streamy's YouTube channel for backstage interviews with all your favorite creators presented by CarMax. Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy Award winners. Monday, although if you are not, that is completely understandable. And remember, it is okay to feel exhausted right now because this is not normal, but do not let that turn into apathy. Do not disengage from what is happening because holy Toledo, it's gonna matter what you think soon. It's going to matter what you want to see in this world. And that's where I'm gonna end today's show. If I were to ask you how you describe yourself, or, or, or what you do on the internet? And I know this is a tough question. Mm -hmm. What would you say for the people who aren't familiar with JoJo Siwa? So, okay, so what I do on the internet is I create YouTube videos. I film my life every day and upload it. I do JoJo's Juice. But then I also have the side of me that is not just a YouTuber. <coughs> oh! Stay on top. <laughs> Hey, what's going on everybody? For First We Feast, I'm Sean Evans and you're watching Hot Ones. It's the show with hot questions and even hotter wings. And today, by popular demand, I'm joined by Terry Crews. First time I went online, it was on my parents' huge computer. <laughs> Remember that? Oh, it was a journey to get to the internet. My first memory online was playing like those Disney Channel games on their site. As soon as I set foot on the internet, chat rooms with strangers and my parents didn't know. I downloaded Napster and put a lot of viruses on my family's computer. And that's it. That's what I did. The first viral video I saw was Smosh Food Battle video. Smosh doing the Pokemon. Jenna Marbles YouTube video. She's a legend. It was interesting. The first star of the internet is Jeffrey Star. I think the first star of the internet was Fred. I mean, that guy had his own movie, so. Applause for longevity. Good morning, everybody. Happy Streamies Day. I am presenting the first person award tonight presented by GoPro Hero 8 Black, but first. So in the spirit of the first person award tonight, I'm gonna be vlogging my entire day all the while showing you some of the coolest features on GoPro Hero 8 Black. There's a ton of amazing nominees in tonight's category. Speaking of which, we got David Dobrik. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to eat this to give me some energy for this crazy day. Just kidding, I don't eat bread. Give me bread, come on. Yeah, speaking of crazy energy, looks like it's time for a walk. Let's go, bud. What you got? Come here, come here, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Wow, look at that view. Let's take a photo of that, hold on. Another nominee, Emma Chamberlain. That's actually kind of great. GoPro, shoot burst. Cool. Congrats on the nomination, Tana. The rest of you guys gotta go so I can get ready. All right, guys, well, I'm just about ready to hit the Streamy Awards. Congratulations to all the incredible nominees here tonight. Good luck, you're gonna be amazing. I'll see you guys there. Hey, what's up, everybody? How you guys doing? What up? Oh, oh, yes! Yes, oh man, guys, these nominees uh, all put all their hearts and faces into what they put the, out there with their fans, and we love them for it. Um, you see the nominees, so now let's reveal the winner. You guys ready for this? Here we go. David Dobrik.
Hi guys. Uh, thank you guys. Hi Tana. <laughs> Tana, you're so easy to spot. You're gonna be my eye line for the rest of the for the rest of the night. Um, no, this is so exciting. I I can't. I can't do literally anything without my friends. So I want to say a big thank you to all 75 of them who are sitting in this section right here. Um, thank you to Jeff for being uh, our new sexiest friend. I want to thank all David's bullies for bullying him. He wouldn't be here without you. So thank you to my job. bullies. Um, no, but seriously, this means a lot. I uh, really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, have a good night. Thank you, guys. This queen in Lettos has caught the eye of some of the biggest celebrities in the world. Please welcome Aaliyah Janelle. One of the biggest songs of the year was Lil Nas X's Old Town Road. In a close second were the approximately 700 million YouTube remixes of Old Town Road. From SpongeBob to Thanos, everyone was remixing it. But my favorite were the dance remixes, obviously. And now in a performance choreographed by Kyle Hanagami featuring D Sharp on violin and some of your dance nominees, let's take a trip to Old Town Road. makes this stage her kitchen. Back in a few. Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy Award winners. Wall to attend a dinner party. I unleashed an evil. This year I am choreographing the Screamy Awards. It's my first time choreographing, but my second time being nominated.
I mean, hopefully everything goes smoothly and hopefully the dancing looks good. Um, if it doesn't, somebody else choreographed it, but if it looks great, it was all me. There's nothing cringe about these next two presenters. Please welcome Cody Ko and Noel Miller. To the tune of Old Town Road. Gonna take my dance to the old dance floor. I'm gonna dance until I can't no more. Can't nobody tell us nothing. Do you know what Old Town Road is? No idea. Okay, got it. Uh, Cody Co are, and I are here to present the Streamy Award for Dance. And here's a little refresher of the nominees. Dance. Ditto. Kyle Hanagami. Matt Stefanina. And Wildebeest Adams. And the Streamy Award uh, for Dance goes to... Ditto. Okay, I did not see this coming or I would have changed back into my other outfit. Um, I, I want to say thank you. Uh, I make videos all the time and I do them last minute, so I'm forced to make them come so far from my heart because they're not planned. And, and I just, I love to freestyle. I just love to express who I am. And I, I love music and I love that music is for everyone and that you all can share that with me. It means the world to me. And I did not see this coming. Thank you guys. <laughs> Get ready for some funny business. It's Gus Johnson and Jack Douglas. As I was going to go first, you said I was going to take it first. I don't want this one anymore. You feel Fashion is defined as a popular aesthetic expression within a certain time and, and context. context. Stop. Don't. Dude, I'll feel. I'm not a second chair guy. And these following nominees are certainly, certainly of their, their time and, and definitely, definitely. Hold on. In con. It says. It says Jack. Context. Right. It says Jack. Just right there. Just read the Jack ones if it's going to throw you off so bad. I no, take it, take it. They truly are the North Stars of influencer fashion. fashion. When I see them, I am reminded of the legendary Coco Chanel, who once said, I, I don't, don't do fashion, fashion. I, I am fashion. <laughs> Beautiful. Check out this package from the Fine Brothers with the nominees for, for fashion. fashion. Good job. So today's episode is extra special. Okay. This episode is being released at the Streamies. What? Y'all look real cute. The category that we're presenting is fashion and you get to react to the nominees. Oh, crazy. There's no better person to do the fashion category than fashion himself. The nominees for fashion are best dressed. First, I'm tucking my t-shirt in all the way around to- Yes! And I'm also rolling Who up some of my jeans to reveal some of that sexy, sexy ankle action. And oh, I have lots of those. Look at her, she's like simple cute. Colleen Diaz. So here we are basically going oh, to this? the Nike Sakai collab. I actually those are fire. Love. She's like what you see on Instagram she's and you're like, oh, I can wear that. And then you buy something like that and you're like, oh, I can't wear that. She thinks that's hot? Patrick Starr. And I'll just smooth that onto my face. We take the extra juice and you drink it. 
Stop it. Last night my shoes broke. Well, we got them fixed. We go. Ah. Uh, and we're able to walk a tonight's show without a hitch. Oh wow, cool. Sierra Schultz. -y. So the first item. Which one, Sierra Schultz? Sierra and Schultz. I was walking there this morning. It actually, did look kind of one size fits all. Cool. Like That's not that bad. It seems like one size fits all. And with love, Lena. This next piece is where I've tried to add a little bit more color. So I found this beautiful kimono hmm. slash wrap dress. Look at her whole dress. aesthetic. This gorgeous. I like her purse. Whoa, that thing's badass. Color. I wish I could give them all the award. And the winner for fashion is... Do, do, you, want to, do you want to say it with me? Please take this one. Okay. <laughs> Patrick Starr! <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Um, to all of you in the community, thank you for embracing the unknown and the unheard, the LGBTQ community. Um, it really means a lot that we're able to provide visibility for the unheard and the bullied, and that's my job as a beauty creator, and I guess now a fashion creator to, to share that, but it does take a team, and this is my team behind me, but if you're watching and you're having a bad day, make a friend on social media. If you know someone having a bad day, make a friend in them. We're here to empower those that don't feel as beautiful as they do, but I'm here to tell you that you're beautiful and that makeup is a one size fits all. Thank you so much. Thank you. The power of the creator community extends far outside of North America. It's worldwide in 91 countries and 80 different languages. So for the first time ever, the streamies are giving out international awards in not one, not two, but three regions. Asia Pacific. Middle East and Africa. And Latin America. The winners of these global streamies are Fishers. <laughs> Mark Angel Comedy. Basto. <laughs> and Camila Lores. <laughs> and now, please welcome two of your Streamy International Award winners, Fishers and Camila Lores. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We are so proud to be a part of the one billion hours of YouTube content watched every day all around the globe. Oi, gente! E aí, galera do Brasil que está acompanhando a live? É com muito orgulho que eu estou aqui representando o Brasil como o melhor youtuber da América Latina. E postar dois vídeos por dia não é fácil, mas estou muito feliz de estar aqui, de né, estar sendo reconhecida assim, enfim. É, bom, o Brasil é o segundo maior público do YouTube no mundo. E nós dois temos uma mensagem para todos os criadores internacionais. Hello everyone from Brazil that is watching the stream. I'm really, really happy to be here representing Brazil that, it, that has the second biggest YouTube audience in the world. It's incredible, but all, uh, we two here have a message for you guys, international creators. So this is, it's a word that I'm going to be able to continue to continue to continue to continue to continue to Keep creating! Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Continue criando! Yeah. 
そして世界中で活動するすべてのクリエイターに感謝を伝えたいです Before we go, we want to give a shout out to all the international creators, both around the world. E todos que estão aqui no streams hoje à noite. Se cai de no creator na Minasanto, e só no YouTube, ou Moria Gera Tarina, ou Motte Olimas. Thank you. Japanese say, Arigato! Arigato! Coming up, Brandon Rogers hosts the first ever live streamies game show. And later, the Audience Choice Awards for Creator and Show of the Year. BRB. Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy Award winners. I'm walking tall and now the day is calling It's like I'm two feet off the ground and there's no way of falling I, 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 I know just where I'm going I, 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 the only way is knowing I'm never giving up oh. You that guy from that restaurant player He was one of many We are the Society of Elmers Nah, no, there ain't no such thing as that dog You don't see our people because we hide in plain sight. Shopping clerks, security guards. Welcome to the stage, the Streamy Social Good Award honoree for St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. Five years ago, when we started our St. Jude Play Live campaign, we had no idea what we were getting ourselves into. Well, in 2014, we officially launched St. Jude Play Live, and in that first year, we raised $520,000 just through creators and streamers out there talking about us and inspiring their communities to give. Well, fast forward, by the end of this coming fiscal year, St. Jude Play Live will have raised $20 million for the life saving mission of St. Jude. So, yes, thank you. Streamy Social Good Award honoree, Mark Applier, for My Friend's Place. Mark couldn't be here.、Um, on behalf of Mark, thank you so much. Thanks for the streamies. And it, it's so great that all these、uh, amazing things that people are doing on、uh, YouTube and on these online platforms shows the power of creators and their community. So, thank you. <laughs> Just watch this. I miss you when I blink. This is my Louis Vuitton purse. <laughs> Make low and bold, great again. It's about to get insane. Pay attention. Spoiler alert, I'm not straight. I'm good! Surprise! <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> oh my god! No, 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 no. no. What is it gonna be? Thanks to everybody. <laughs> How are you feeling, eh? Oh, I feel it too. I do know that things will get better. Time changes everything. Oh my god. I love him so much. Talk about how you feel because you're not the only one that feels it. Sometimes life is about experiences. Now I'm just gonna just burst with tears. n a n i We're having a ball. Back to your regularly scheduled programming. <laughs> I'm so excited to be presenting the award for health and wellness tonight. When I feel excited, actually, when I, I feel anything, I tend to bake. So that's exactly what I'm going to be doing right here. I'm going to make a streamies cookie. Um, so, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take one of these cookies 
Uh, these are zero calories. I spent years developing this recipe, so uh, look for it in my next cookbook. And then I'm gonna take some icing. I can also juggle, I'm very talented. I'm gonna take some icing, do a little decorating, and uh, what you wanna do is pipe an outline around the outside of the cookie, then flood it. That's filling in the cookie. You wanna be really careful, don't make a mess, you know? Want these to look pristine. This is an award show, after all. And once we're done, I mean, take a look at what we've created. I, oh yes, don't forget extra decorations. <laughs> and ta-da, we have made the perfect Streamies cookie to celebrate. <laughs> oh, this is like my finest <laughs> work. <laughs> <laughs> and now, let's let Zach King show us the nominees while we eat the rest of these cookies. <laughs> 98, 99, 100. Oh, hey everybody, I'm Zach King, and you may know me for my magic, but I'm actually quite the natural athlete, as you can tell. And that's why I've been asked to announce the streaming nominees for health and wellness. So, let's just get to it. Your nominees for health and wellness this year are Dr. Mike. For better or worse, I get the McDreamy thing a lot. The fitness marshal. You love yourself, but in a very contained way right now. Okay, go crazy. Jay Shetty. What if we woke up tomorrow with only what we were grateful for today? What would we have left? Katie Morton. Life cannot be completely free from anxiety or upset. Life comes with its ups and downs. And Prince EA. In literally more than a century, nothing has changed. Yet you claim to prepare students for the future? And now, let's find out who your health and wellness winner is. And the winner for health and wellness is... Jay! Jay! Thank you, Streamies. I've just been told there might be some icing left on this too, so um, I will try to grab that later. But just want to say thank you to all the incredible creators who are in this room, the amount of talent, passion, creativity that exists in here. I really believe that we can change the world from the power that exists within this room. And this award belongs to every creator that's trying to help the 450 million people currently suffering from a mental health condition. So thank you so much to each and every one of you. Thank you so much, Streamies. Thank you. of the Streamies only game show. You don't know squad, and I'm your host, Sam. How about some clap for me? Well, today we're gonna test some of y'all influencers' knowledge on internet and such. I'm gonna bring some contestants up to the stage to meet me. If your name is Lizzie Carter or Stubbs Kitchen, get on down here because you're team number one! Oh, and we've got a pink lady coming in. Oh, and we've got some guys. Oh, those are our contestants. Let's get up on up here. Hurry, this is some live show, lady. Now, what's your name? Oh, Lizzie, and you, you're just team one. Applause for team one. Yes. All right. Now we're going to have team two. If your name is Matt Slave, Rebecca, Zamella, or Chloe, get on up here. Oh, look how fashionable everyone looks. We've got some big shoulders and a skirt that above the knees. Oh, and a great bow tie. Do a round of applause for the young have a silence here. All right, please stand right here. Hey, you don't do them. All right, now we have the first question for you. What's your name? My name is Carter. Carter, oh, that's good. Whose music video had the most views 
in 2019. BTS, Lil Nas X featuring Billy Ray Cyrus, or Maz Shawn Mendes, Camila Cabello, Senorita? Uh, Lil Nas? No, it was Senorita. Oh my God, let's see if, hey, watch it. This is not Will of Fortune. Let's see here. Team two, can you get a point? If you are a Bisca girl, you have at least three of what? Um, uh, yeah. Okay, scrunchy Hydro Flask and a Mario. It was scrunchy, it was just scrunchy. You didn't get the point. No, don't clap, she added stuff. All right, team one, let's see how this question is for you. What did Kanye West find this year? Wrong, it was gone! I was gonna say that! Now, I don't like team one so far. Let's see here, team two. Now I'm gonna throw a little bit of science in the mix. At what temperature does ice cubes turn done turn into water? I mean, the uh, water is uh, the one where it gets hard. 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Thir well, it's 32 dot Fahrenheit, but that's good! You got the point! <laughs> Team one, you have a lot of reshaping to do. We will I'm gonna ask you a one. question right here. Don't look, you <laughs> sneaky. What was Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson's makeup paletti called? Come on. We know. Conspiracy. Cons yes, yeah, conspiracy! Come on. Yeah. Boy, team Let's one! Go. All right, team two, who had the most views this year? David Dobrik, Dude Perfect, Brandon Rogers, Pencil Nation, or PewDiePie? Dude Perfect. No, it Beauty, was PewDiePie. PewDiePie. Team two, I had faith in you. <laughs> all right, we have a last question, and this goes to everyone. This last question will determine the winner. I determined that all questions leading up till now are pointless. Now let's see what you're playing for. Do we have a prize? Where is that prize? Yeah. Oh. Oh, we got a horn in case my choo way out this lobby in style. And we got a frozen pizza. There's a lot at stake here. Are you all ready Let's for this it. last question? We're ready. We're ready. Let's do it. This. I'm an actor. This is the ninth annual Streamy Awards. What year was the first annual Streamy Awards? Go! 2009? Yes! 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 You get the pizza and you get to get off my stage. Go that way right there. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Get off. Get out. Go. And this is my reminder to y'all, keep the annual population down. Cut off your cats and dogs' balls. And now, Please welcome one of the founders of Team Trees, Mark Rober. What up, Team Trees? So the, the last two months have been crazy. Six months ago, when I was first talking with Mr. Beast about how in the world we could possibly accomplish planting 20 million trees, the only thing that was clear from that conversation was that to pull this off, it would need to be a massive community effort. And right out of the gate, we were blown away by the response from so many of our fellow creators willing to step up and show some love to freaking Mother Earth. And now, because so many of the people in this room, so many of you watching, so many school bake cells, plus a little help from Trilon Musk, we are so close to actually achieving our insane goal. In 49 days, Team Trees has planted, I'm checking the website, 18,404,738 trees! <laughs> 745, sorry, or 69, sorry. Keeps going up, this is great. What a cool freaking community that we are part of that we could pull something like that off. So as celebration of how far we've come, here are the best moments from you, the Team Trees community, and a special Streamies message from Mr. Beast himself. To celebrate Mr. Beast having 20 million subscribers, he should plant 20 million trees. 20 million trees. The statistics may not be in our favor, but we got great. So like
<laughs> We're calling it Team Trees. Team Trees. Let's plant some trees. I'm so excited. We could end up with too many trees. I am so in. Proud members of Team Trees. I would plant at least a couple of trees. It feels like the end of Power Rangers when they would all assemble into the big thing and fight stuff together and do good. It's really inspiring. So you're gonna take the dollar, put it in some dirt, and then pull it. Boom. You get a tree. Oh, wow. For every dollar donated, one tree will be planted. Hell yeah. Planting a tree is sexy. Meet the tree zooka. <laughs> That's insane. Plant some trees or donate a few dollars to teamtrees.org. Hey Streamies, I'm Mr. Beast, and I'm really sorry I can't be there with you, Mark, but um, I'm actually filming a video right now titled, Last to Take Their Hand Off $1 Million Keeps It. And for obvious reasons, I can't really leave right now, but um, uh, Team Trees, regardless, has been a massive success. Like, literally, we've raised enough money to plant over 18 million trees, which is insane. And um, basically, our goal is to plant 20 million trees by the end of the year. So if you're watching this right now, if you could go to teamtrees.org and donate, every dollar you donate, a tree will be planted around the world. And that's just crazy. It's insane how simple it is, you know? And our goal is to plant 20 million trees by 2020. So uh, if you could do that, that'd mean the world to me. And shout out to the streamies. Hey guys, it's Kate the Chemist. Coming up, a world premiere from Patrick Starr. Hannah's stocking hits the streets, and we're serving up the Streamy Awards for food and science and education. Now here's a little science and education for you. Do you know what happens when you add potassium iodide to hydrogen peroxide? Let's see. This! Oh! <laughs> Stick around. The streamies will be right back. Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy Award winners. I'm so glad that you're here. I, um, I'm sober now. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. And um, actually, I, uh, one of the steps is to apologize. Hey. <laughs> oh, uh, what was the first question? What's the question again? <laughs> I know I do for my two. No, let me do one more. <laughs> one more alt. Should I do that again? Sorry, one more time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I completely made that up. <laughs> okay, I made that up too. <laughs> uh, beep. Oh, guys, you gotta do this. Thank you for your time. out of this beautiful audience and you know the only thing yes the only thing wrong is that nobody's dancing so could I get everyone to stand up out of your chairs and your beautiful gowns you're looking like I'm crazy stand up this goes for you at home too everyone out of your seats off your couches you just have to follow along with us thank you oh you're up yes squad squad slide to the right and point at your type yes Oh, that's your type, David Dobrik. You nasty. That's my type. That's my type. That's my type. Tana, I've seen you get lower than that. That's my type. That's my type. Throw it up. What? Again? Whoa. 
Oh my God. All that dancing got me so hungry. Good thing food is the next category. Please welcome Joey Graceffa. There is so much food content available these days from Food Network to the Great British Bake Off, but honestly, no one does it like YouTube creators. These ain't your mom's cooking shows. So here's Anthony Padilla with the nominees for food. Food, a substance consumed in order to provide nutrients in the body of an organism to sustain growth and vital processes. Every living organism known by mankind requires a conversion of food into energy for survival and will do anything in its power to ensure consumption in order to prevent death. But what does a species do after harnessing the power of agriculture and factory farming to produce seemingly limitless amounts of food? They create culinary masterpieces that meticulously merge awe-inspiring visual artistry with a symphony of flavors that ignite the senses. My name's Anthony Padilla, and today I'm gonna be announcing the ninth annual Streamy nominees for food to bequeath this honor upon the true cream of the crop. Without further ado, this year's nominees are Binging with Babish. Oh, um, sorry you had to see that. Nobody's allowed to make a meme of that. That's Food Fears by Good Mythical Morning. It's still kind of the worst pizza I've ever had. That's fair enough. Gordon Ramsay. The secret behind any great burger is in the grill. Crank that thing up. Rosanna Pancino. I'm the fun aunt. I'm also your only aunt. <laughs> Worth It by BuzzFeed Video. Ooh, only lava was so... <laughs> Best of luck to the nominees. <laughs> Ouch, that time it really hurt. Oh, good. Okay, and the winner is Binging with Babish. Is anyone coming? No? Rosanna, do you want this? <laughs> okay, well, I guess they're not here to accept the award. Sorry. Okay. Are they? Are they coming? Oh my god, okay! Woohoo! There you go. Uh, this is not my award, and I swear I'm not pulling a Kanye West right now. Uh, I'm not binging with Babish. My voice does not sound like the uh, movie trailer voiceover guy, but he did ask me to accept on his behalf. Andrew was on my show, Food Fears, and I might have made a bet where I agreed if he won and I lost, I would get a tattoo of his face somewhere on my body. And looks like I'm gonna do that. So uh, if anybody has any suggestions where to get his face tattooed, I'm probably gonna lie to people and say it's my grandpa. But uh, for real, I've looked, <laughs> I've looked up to Andrew for a long time. Uh, the YouTube food community is incredible. Uh, food is love, it's community, uh, and everyone out there shows that. And so this is for Andrew. Uh, looking forward to the new ink. Thanks, brother. Don't look now, streamies. It's Nikita Dragon and Collins Key. You know, if you want to learn anything online, there's always a YouTube video to teach you. And that's really where our next category comes in handy. You can learn a new language, create your own at-home science experiment, or even master that meticulous math problem. But really, you can learn anything on YouTube. For example, my body might be 100% plastic, but I'm also still 100% that bitch. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> the science and education videos present us with information in new and exciting ways. And as we all know, it's not always the easiest to make information fun and exciting. Yeah, and good thing our nominees know how to do just that. Yeah, so here's Karen Young to present the science and education nominees. Hey guys, it's me Karen and welcome to my beauty room. Today I'm so excited to be presenting the nominees for science and education. In fact, I use science and learn how to clone myself. Presenting Karen 2.0. <laughs> Karen 
Karen, if you're gonna lie in bed all day, at the very least, you can announce the Streaming Awards winners, okay? And the nominees for Science and Education are Ants Canada. Now, where in Ant-Man's quantum world am I? The ant wondered as she waved her antennae through the air, trying her best to smell what lay beyond. Kurtz Kazakht in a nutshell. Loneliness is a bodily function like hunger. Hunger makes you pay attention to your physical needs. Loneliness makes you pay attention to your social needs. Mark Rober. This guy took a package from my porch, and now he's about to open it in his car, but what he doesn't know is this is a custom-built bait package that is recording him on four different cameras, and it's about to unleash a pound of the world's finest glitter, along with some other surprises. Mind Field, Season 3. Are we truly alone in the universe? Or is everyone else acting like us and just doing a lot of listening? Maybe we need to be louder. SciShow. But no matter where you go, you will probably get some unwanted attention from a certain flying bloodsucker. That's right, it's summer, it's mosquito season, in the Northern Hemisphere anyway. And the streamy for science and education goes to... Mark Rober! <laughs> This is cool. This is the music set, yeah. So uh, getting people pumped about science and education is something that I truly am passionate about. So honestly, this means a lot to me. Um, I will say why I'm up here. I only do 12 videos a year, and for the past 11 months, I've been building and testing and putting on porches in all of America Glitter Bomb 2.0, and I'm putting it out this Sunday at 9 a.m., and I think you guys are gonna like it. <laughs> Punish those thieves, but honestly, uh, this is important, and, and for me personally, this means a lot, so I really appreciate it. Hi, I'm Hannah Stocking, and I'm gonna bust into all my friends' apartments and give them presents. Merry Christmas! Oh my god! Who told you? My two it's favorite. Still intact. Yeah. Oh, mm. I love it. Um, can you get out now? Merry Christmas! Well, there it is. That's all I needed to know. I don't want anything else. Alright, this is Rudy's house. He's sleeping on the couch. Merry Christmas. How are you doing, my house? So Christmas came early at the Streamies this year. Now I've got some presents in my stocking because I'm Hannah stocking for a few lucky creators in the audience. So come with me. First up, we have Marquez. Uh, have you been naughty or nice this year? Nice. OK. Yeah. Well, here you go. Got a flip flown. Thank you. I love these. I love these. Me Thank too. You. All right, come with me again. Who else do we have? Hi, Queen. Oh, wow, I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> we have Key and JC. You have a word for the people? Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, wait, here, I got uh, it. I've been nice as well. Okay, that's good. Where, yeah. Kean's in the restroom. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. We'll have a present waiting for him when he okay, comes back. Okay, there's, there's a present over there. You too, got a... One of the coolest oh, wow. hoodies in the game. It has the best uh, communication, actually. Hi, how are You're you? Welcome. Oh, I like it. Thank you. I'll, All okay. Right. Thank, what thank could you. we have next? Here we go. <laughs> All right. Whoa, whoa. Here it comes. Oh, you know it. Oh, I know. So, Zane, I'm going to give you the next gift. Do you have a word for the people? Um, hello. <laughs> hey, Zane, we always want you to take care of yourself because the whole world loves you. So we got you a first aid kit. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that is absolutely incredible. Thank you so much. You are most welcome. I'll wear it right now. Okay. I'll wear it right now. <laughs> All right. Now, next up, we have Heath. Oh, me too. What's up? Okay. 
Okay, we have a very important gift for you. A Heath oh. bar. Just because it says my name? Yeah. All right, well, thank you. Okay, and last but not least, we have a present for somebody who has been very giving, David Dobrik. You've gotten a lot of people cars, so we got you a car as well. A Honda Civic, a little toy car. You're most welcome. So clearly I'm no Oprah. Enough with the present giving, let's get back to the award giving. Please welcome to the stage, Amber's Closet and the Opposite Twins, Nikki and Gabby! What's up? Hey guys. Hey. hey. Hi guys. We have a triplet now. Yeah. yeah. Welcome to the family. I'm here, you know what I mean, and queer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they always say two heads. Or three. Are better than one. But having more voices in the room doesn't always make it easier. We should know that. Yeah. <laughs> Being in an ensemble requires patience, cooperation, and most of all, a shared sense of... Oh, right. Timing. Yeah. The following nominees have all of the above. So here are the nominees for the best ensemble. Ensemble cast. Escape the Night, season four. You guys get what I asked for? Yeah. What took you so long? So is this about time to mention that I invited someone to the party? The party's here. Mr. Beast. Bananas. Since you picked out the bananas, you get $500. We didn't want these rotten bananas and we didn't want to throw them away, so here's $500, man. Oh my gosh, your bananas stink. The Try Guys. Again, this is what you don't want to do, but if you're too close, you're going to take his paint off like this. That's really not what we want there. The Valley Folk. Bradley Pitts asked, Brad what's... Pitt! What? Yeah, right? Oh my god, what? it feels... No, it feels so good because I've been a fan Can't of him for guys. so long. <laughs> Vlog Squad. <laughs> been up for a while. This is what they do in the back of AA meetings. <laughs> keep going, keep going. Five more seconds shooting. Five, four, three, two, fire! And, and then streamy for ensemble cast goes to... The Vlog Squad! Zane, Zane brought his wine. Yeah. Um, thank you for the first aid kit for Zane. No, um, we, we are like so, so incredibly grateful that we get to do this. And the fact that we get to do this all together and that we have such a strong friend group around is like, it means like the entire world. And it's crazy that we get, we're standing here another year. I don't know how, how we did it. I don't know how we're this lucky. But um, yeah, Zane's barely standing. <laughs> Zane's been through a lot. No, but we're really, really appreciative. And I feel like a lot of people don't understand about YouTubers about like, how much work goes into every single person's videos. And it's really cool to be recognized. And all these guys work so hard. And all, most of them end up in the hospital. So I really appreciate that. And Vardon wants to say something, too. I don't know. Uh, hi, everybody. Thank you all so, so much. Um, and I would do, for all of us, I, I think I'm talking for all of us. But this wouldn't have been done without you guys and without David. So thank you all so, so much. Well done. Yeah. Thank you guys, bye. Bye. <laughs> wow. How much do I when we return, the one and only Patrick Starr. Mark Rober shows off some surprising new technology and Normani hits the streaming stage. Keep it right here on the YouTube Streamy Awards, brought to you by Black Christmas. Sustain, 
Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy White Award House. winners. Yay! Go, Fisha Silvia. No, it's Masa. What a k. Oranda ni kito rimasu. Yay! Wipeout ote mina san gozon de. Yeah, let's see this. I'm going home. <laughs> <laughs>
like can't even like ugh. <sighs> and the queen taking home the stream is this shit's hard hold on oh fuck oh fuck nikita, nikita dragon <laughs> I guess this is not a great time to uh, say that I uploaded the last time three months ago. Um, love YouTube. <laughs> uh, I guess I can speak on behalf of all of us in the beauty community. I think there's been a lot of attention in this past year, but I know going forward, we're all wanting to take a step in the right direction, get back to what it's really about, just beauty. And for me, obviously, being a little boy from Springfield, Virginia, like five years ago and sharing my journey, being a proud trans woman and now, thank you, thank you. Um, showing surgeries, showing breakups, showing body parts getting chopped off. Um, it, it's been a really, really crazy journey, so thank you so much. You know, a bad bitch get awards too, okay. I don't know, what am I supposed to do? Thank you. <laughs> With his perfect chi and contagious love of science, it's Mark Rober. The world of tech moves fast. It's constantly changing and evolving. It's like trying to follow a beauty blogger feud online. The creators in the tech space are always on top of their game, helping us decode, decipher, and demystify every new gadget that comes our way. Here are the nominees. Technology. I Justine. This also has the A10 Fusion chip, so it is incredibly fast. Marquez Brownlee. This is everything you need to know so far in one place. Sarah Dietschy. So this bag can fit a 15 inch computer. Tech Kaboom. We get to see kind of the word on the street, like what do people know about these two phones? Let's get these things open. And Unbox Therapy. Oh man. Okay, this is insane. They gave me an envelope to announce the winner, uh, but that's lame. So I've actually put a package on the table of everyone who's nominated. Uh, so bring this out, see what we got here. All right. So in order to announce it, I'm just gonna like push this down. So if you guys are ready to see who won the technology counter, count me down. Five, four, Three, two, one. Hey! I'll tell you what, that was terrifying. Um, thank you. Thank you to uh, the streamies. Thank you to everyone else in the category. Similar to Mark, I feel like I take a lot of pride in, <laughs> I take a lot of pride in uh, getting people interested and entertained with tech, which I think is really important. First year there's been a tech category. I think that's great. Also, I don't know where Hannah is. I, I got the phone like out the box, but it was really, I set the language to Spanish by accident. So if someone could help me switch that back, that'd be awesome. Anyway, thank you so much. Have a great night. There are only two streamies left. Your audience choice award for creator of the year and show of the year. And then a show-stopping performance by Normani. Don't go anywhere, the streamies will be right back. Congratulations to these 2019 Streamy Award winners. Okay, 
So I'm a little nervous because no one's ever really seen the inside of my house. Now, not because I don't, I don't mind, you know me, I, I'm, I've shot off my whole life on the internet yeah. from cars to bags to surgeries. Right. <laughs> um, but me and Nate do try to keep a little bit of privacy for the internet. But um, I think once you buy three houses, you just gotta get over it and show one. To my esteemed friends, I invite you all to attend a dinner party. <laughs> Unleashed an evil. No. Put it in. Hurry, guys. And it crept inside me. Here is the history of the streamies. The streamies were invented in 1972. In 1800 BC. When Will Smith and Joanne the Scammer. And Abraham Lincoln and Zac Efron got together and decided it was time to jump the internet. They needed to sword fight the internet. The first streamies, some would say, was pretty sexy. Sexy. Things ran lively. Ran crazily. There were quite a few dogs. And one or two chairs. Crickets, fishes, horses. And one or two balls. This year's streamies is going to be smelly. Elon Musk is here. Gene Dawson is here. Quite fluffy. Will Lily Singh's record of most dramatic wins be beat this year? Will David Dobrik take home the most babies? Ooh. That last part was spicy. One is the food critic queen, and the other is a motivational monk. Please clap for Kaylin Allen and Jay Shetty. Woo! Now this is a big award, and I'm nervous. I'm real nervous, man, okay? Damn! Yeah, <laughs> this is a big award. Partially because the people at home get to choose who wins. That's right. Uh-huh, and because there are 10 nominees. That's also right. Ooh, I'm nervous, that's a lot of folks. Kaylin, this isn't about you. You right. <laughs> and the nominees for Audience Choice Show of the Year are... Show of the Year. Chicken Girls. Escape the Night, Season 4. The Game Master. Good Mythical Morning. Hot Ones. The Philip DeFranco Show. React. Red Table Talk. Tiny Meat Gang Podcast. And The Try Guys. And the streamy for Audience Choice Show of the Year goes to... Good, Good Mythical, Mythical Morning! Morning. I think there may have been a mistake, but I am. No, our uh, fans voted for this. The Mythical Beast voted for this. <laughs> Thank you, Mythical <laughs> Beast. Yeah, we uh, we drank each other's urine on our show. <laughs> and at the time, I doubted us. But it sure does taste good now. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, we want to thank, we couldn't, we've been doing this show for a lot of years. We would have stopped a long time ago if we didn't have an incredible team. Many of them are right here. Thank you, guys. Um, and, and of course, like has been said already, I mean, this, what we're doing in this community is just a ridiculous thing that we have this 
these communities that build up around the work that we're doing, uh, and it becomes this very reciprocal thing where we're kind of creating in the context of a community, and then they decide on things like this. Very democratic process. Uh, so we want to thank the fans, we want to thank the Mythical Beast for uh, supporting us all these years and helping yeah, and us we wanna, keep going. And we want to thank all fans because uh, whether you're inspired by us, which is totally humbling, or by someone else here, what all you guys do is absolutely amazing because it connects with an audience and it, and it inspires people. Uh, with whatever life throws at them, you guys are the ones who are the inspiration uh, that, that gives them a spark, whatever they need. So thank you guys. Thank you, Streamies. Please welcome filmmaker, entrepreneur, and all-around OG YouTube guru, Casey Neistat. Hey guys. Uh, this year's nominee for Audience Choice of Creator of the Year have all done amazing things with content spanning genres from lifestyle to beauty to gaming to game changing. All of these creators have gone above and beyond to share their lives and passions with their audience. Okay, we have some good, good nominees this year. Okay, here are the nominees for Creator of the Year. Creator of the Year. Collins Key. David Dobrik. Emma Chamberlain. Lily Singh. Lauren Gray. Mr. Beast. Ninja. Sophia Nygaard. Simply Neological. And Tana Mojo. Wait, did you see the name or that's who you think it is? You didn't see it. Who you guys think it is? I don't want to make a big deal out of this, but it is not, it is not David Dobrik. <laughs> I'm sorry, David, but you've won like every award tonight. It's only fair. <laughs> Tana. Tana. This feels like one of those like mean girl moments where I should like break it off and give it to everybody who actually f deserves it because I don't deserve this at all. I'm like I don't feel like creator of the year. I've never felt like creator of the year. I feel like the the misfit, the outcast, the f all of those things. And I stood right here a year ago and I literally held Shane Dawson's award and the first thing I said to all of you people was like I will never be creator of the year. Um <laughs> I just, I, I really just want to say thank you to the only people who saved my life and got me here, and that is my fans and Shane Dawson. So thank you so much for inspiring me to make this kind of stuff. And thank you to my manager, Jordan, and my team around me and everybody for supporting me. I've never, I've never, I never thought this would happen. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, I'm going to go sob now. Here's to all the people who don't feel like creator of the year. Get ready. How y'all feeling out there? 
ਨਾ ਦੇ Congratulations to all of the winners. We'll see you next decade, Stevie. Good night.